Hey YouTube, been a while. Decided to uh, go ahead and take down some of the uh, Halloween decorations. Here it is after Halloween, so might as well. Anyway, it's kind of putting stuff away and notice something about uh, gas cans, especially the uh, two or three that I have. Didn't seem much at the time, but now that I'm looking at it, I'm not quite sure. I mean, I have two gas cans there. And one seemed to be, uh, you know, regular gas can. And the other one's this new fangled no-spill gas can. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. Because this no-spill gas can, if you take a look at the side real close, I'm not, kinda, I'm not liking that. Now, I thought it was a fluke during the summer because it expanded. But now that it's getting colder and the gas is uh, uh, reacting with the weather, it's basically imploding, if you will. Uh, at least the gas can is anyway. Now, the regular gas can, if you look at it, it's just sitting there doing nothing. Um, actually, it has room to vent through here and this isn't really all that sealed so yeah it vents which compensates for for the weather uh, now as far as this other gas can let's move this one out of the way this other gas can it doesn't vent um, even if you take the the cap off nothing happens so we're going to put the cap back on now you do notice that this here turns so it should vent but it's not these newfangled gas cans I don't know about them I think I'll stick with the old-fashioned gas cans. They seem to work better. And uh, I don't have any problems with them. Now, the new gas can, I'm going to have to let air into it. And uh, hopefully that will fix the problem. But, you know, I'm going to have to come out to the garage every couple of weeks just to check on this dang thing. I don't know. Let's go ahead and let the air out of it. We'll let it out by pushing this little green button here. And watch what happens to the can. Not much of anything, really. But you did hear the air come out of it. That one, seems to be about the same density. And they both have gas in it. I don't know. But what I am going to do is I'm going to empty out the uh, newfangled gas can. The no spill into the old gas can and that way I won't have to worry about it if it crushes itself during the winter fine if it expands to the point where it blows up during the summer 
so be it. I really don't care. As long as it doesn't do any damage to my property, I'm good to go. Let me know what you think about these gas cans. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Hit that uh, little subscribe button right down here. Hit the bell icon so you don't miss any future videos. And uh, I'm going to say happy camping. Talk to you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>